Hello? Anyway, let's play Mystic Mesa, right? Um... You know what we're gonna do today in Mystic Mesa is actually, so yeah, I just saw that Maddie put a link in the chat for the VOD channel. I will look out the, I will look at the um, comments on that channel pretty regularly. Um, and someone in the comments on that channel was like, you are not understanding the dinosaurs and their feeding. Like, that's how Compsig Nathan died, is that a dinosaur can say that it's at 100%, but its food could be completely out. You've got to use the book to know what its food is, because then it's not like if the food is out, then they're slowly going to go down 100%. Like, they are very, like, they will die quickly once that food goes empty. So I've been on a dinosaur spree and today we need to take a break from the armor. I need to fully commit myself to dinosaur feeding. And I don't know, like we need to see pretzel as pretzel gets older and assess whether or not pretzel is suitable for the Jurassic Bark because they might not be they might be aggressive like they're an herbivore yes but they also uh, so the thing about the Pachycephalosaurus is it's literally it's it's one of my favorite dinosaurs I usually say, like, well, I love the Parasaurolophus. I love Brachiosaurus when I was a kid. But when I got into college and I started... So if you don't know, <laughs> one of the reasons I love just, like, kind of messing around with the dinosaurs... By the way, we need another piece of glass for right there. Uh, one of the reasons I love messing around with the dinosaurs in this mod pack is that when I was in college, I took a lot of upper division paleontology classes. And it was sort of weird that I did that um, because it wasn't my major at all. So it was odd, I admit it. Um, yeah, it was strange, but I loved them, and I keep hearing a wolf. Oh, yes, Milkbone lives here now, and you're at 77%, and Hercules, okay, it's rainy. Um, let's put away, I don't know, okay, I guess I have carrots there. I don't know, okay, Hercules. Okay, let's just put a couple more. We have enough torches in here. But maybe because you're here now, maybe we should like put a torch like there and there to keep you safe. Okay. Hi, Carissa. Hi, Yelmer. Ah, everyone's here. Wait a minute, Chris. Did you really? You can't, so you can order. Did you really? Did you, you tried it? Have we talked about this? What did you think? I'm so curious. Like, I feel like when I first started talking about it to people, it was like under the safety of like, well, very few people live in Idaho. So hopefully, like, I don't know, I might just have weird taste. Um, but I'd love to know what you actually think about it. Oh, we have two biofossils that we didn't... Oh, because I was, like, trying to get something. I really wanted to, like, spawn some fossils. Like, it makes me really sad that we can't have, like, a fossil in here. That they have to be on the ground. Because this this building's just a little small. So it's like... Oh, that's a Gallimimus! That would be perfect, but, like, it just doesn't fit 
in this like I need to put them outside I guess like like here you know that doesn't look good like I need to have like a dedicated oh it's raining like a dedicated area and some of them don't look good because some of them are so small that they don't look like they would fill up like a building oh that's neat that's kind of cool wait I had two why did it take that's an ankylosaur also one of my favorites so basically what I was saying is when I was in college I got really into a couple other dinosaurs it's delicious it's kind of expensive to ship but I treat it like a dessert uh, that's so cool. Uh, three and a half gallons for $68. You, you can get it by the gallon? I've never, or do you get it by the half gallon? I've never seen it in a gallon container. I've only seen it in a, a half gallon. I literally don't drink milk anymore at all. I gave it up like two years ago, but... No, it won't let them it won't let you put it on top of the cabinets. It only lets you put it on the actual ground. I don't know why. Um, but when I'm in Idaho, I I make an exception and I get the milk because I kind of make an excuse for it because you can sort of like see the cows and so it's still very like the dairy industry is still kind of sad. But at least you can see that they're not being mistreated. But, like, the dairy industry in general is problem is a problem. Like, you, even if the cows are, like, treated in a lovely way, the whole point is that you're still impregnating cows in order to get them to produce milk. And then feeding the babies separately from the mothers so that you can then take the milk for your dairy production. It's not great, but what I would say to people is like this this stuff's just hard, you know? Like my grandfather was a dairy farmer and I respected him so much and like it's just for certain parts of the country that's that's very normal and they just have different feelings about animal rights. And it's like, I kind of can't fault them. Um, like, I can, but to a certain extent, because it's just, you know, the farmer lifestyle has been kind of like, people need to provide for their families. Um, anyway... What was I talking about? So, so when I was in college, I developed a fondness for the ankylosaur and for the pachycephalosaurus um, because they're just really cool. Like they're like, it's a bummer that the dinosaurs went extinct. Um, Wow, look at all the coal that we got. I can't believe... was It was literally like a couple of streams ago, not even that many ago, that I was like, I don't have any coal in Mystic Mesa. And now I have more that won't even fit in there. Oh my gosh. I'm going to have to like... Let's move charcoal to like here. Or like here. And then let's try to fit more coal. Um, the Pachycephalosaurus is really cool because it has something crazy like its skull. At the very top of its skull, there is like nine inches of solid bone. Oh, Elsie, you are red. The shader's glitch has happened. I don't know why. Let me put away all my coal. Maybe that has something to do with it. Um, oh my gosh. You can't store that much coal in here. Great. 
I will never use this much redstone. I can't even put it in there. Same with the lapis, really. I think the lapis is full. Yeah. I don't need all this stuff. Uh, anyway, so solid inches, like nine solid inches of bone in their top of their cranium, which is what allows them to like run into things and um that's just cool like i can't i'm sure that there's an animal that exists nowadays that's like that but at the time i just thought that was really neat i remember going to a lecture with someone that i was friends with in college and i remember like waiting for the dinosaur expert to start speaking and i was like I was like talking about the Pachycephalosaurus and then I didn't know this, but another dinosaur expert was like in the audience to listen to their colleague give this talk at my university science center. And they like turned around and they were like, how do you know all that? <laughs> and I was like, oh, I'm, I'm like, I'm, I'm studying that in school. And they were like, oh, cool. Like, yeah, that's great. And it, like, put that, just file that under signs that I should have majored in, in geology and paleontology. Just, and I, I just was like, well, I'm a journalism major. Sigh. Um, okay, let's see here. I don't know what I'm doing today. I, I, well, I know what I'm doing today because... What the person was saying, too, on my VOD channel thread was actually really terrifying, right? Because they were saying that I also have a dodo bird upstairs. So even if I get all of the feeders situated for the... Charlie? Uh, if I get all the feeders situated for the um, Jurassic Bark, I still need to get something for Mosey, which, like... How am I going to go in their pen? I'm going to have to see if I can... Can I golden lasso Mosey? And then... Um, and then the dodo bird. I can't forget about the dodo bird. But this is pretzel, you guys. Oh, he goes so perfectly in this room! Oh my gosh! Pretzel! My pachycephalosaurus! Come follow me. Come, come here. Do you love me? Hello? Hi! So, you see? He's already super hungry. How are my other dinosaurs not dead? And... Carrots, apples, melon, wheat. Now that the tumbleweed thing is gone, we need to reinstate my crops. Um... Stupid baby zombie. Uh, okay. Prop four. Do we want to go ahead and put the thorns? Oh, we only have six levels. Okay. So. Feather falling one. Feather falling one. How many levels did that take? Seven levels. So what we need to do is we need to get prop two onto this feather falling one pair of boots. I will need a good set of armor if I'm going to go in the cage with Mosey. Um, can we have one dino inside? Oh my gosh, don't tempt me. It would be pretzel. Yes. Let's make pretzel a room. I'm just worried that they will attack other animals is the thing. But I absolutely want to keep pretzel around. So yeah, I'm, I'm down for that. Let's golly. I don't even know. Let's check on dumpling and see. I need to like, remember what they eat and then figure out where to put a feeder. Please don't be dead. Oh my gosh. 
Where? Oh my gosh. Here, 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 here. Okay. Wait. Oh, I might have a reprieve with the do no despawn. Dumpling dodo. I don't think I do. Nuts, seeds, bulbs, roots, and fallen fruit. But I might be okay. Maybe pretzel's room should be behind the painting? Possibly. Um, okay. This room is so cool. Hi, Claire. Um, alright, I'm gonna go down here. Alright, so let's not worry about dumpling for now. Still need to move my egg thing. Uh, let's go... Where? Okay, here's my wheat seeds. And then, do I have a hoe anywhere? I feel like I fixed all of my wheat fields, but that was before we disabled tumbleweeds. And so then I was like, I'm not doing all this again. Ah, here we go. What kind of enchantments can you get on a diamond hoe? Let's do it. Um, oh, my lapis is gone now. Are you kidding me? I just don't have any down here. Um, Okay, let's throw in some of our lapis. Let's convert these to lapis blocks so that we can store them all. Okay, this baby zombie might have to go because it really does, the noise really does bother me. When I'm in this room, I feel like I'm in this room a lot now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. 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 Let's see if we can get a stack. Not quite a stack, but pretty good. Remember the Pandora's box that gave you hay bale trees? You have plenty of wheat from those. Oh my gosh, I do. Uh, what should we do? We should take shears over there and just harvest some of the... Oh, you can't enchant a diamond hoe. Well, I feel, I feel foolish. This is, this is awkward. Um, yeah, I guess, I guess we should do that. Do you use shears on hay bales? Uh, give me a pair of shears. Why, why am I missing just really basic stuff like this still? Like where I know that I have shears here. Punch one. Okay. Why do we need wheat again? Well, wheat or melon, it's just what pretzel eats. And I feel very concerned that I have been like neglect. Like I put a feeder over here, but they're not. It's down on the ground and I don't think anyone eats out of it or is it it's empty I can't tell I just can't tell and so I'm very concerned that all of a sudden like people are gonna die like he's not bad footlong is not bad can I get some footlong emotes 
apples and cookies. So cookies, wheat, like that's the kind of, that's the reasoning. Sugar, we have a sugar cane farm. So, so actually sugar, great. Now what about, pretzel wasn't sugar though, right? Pretzel was, don't be mean to anyone. Pretzel's not sugar. Um, you're not that hungry either, but you're just straight up seeds. The Gallimimus is full. Okay. Um, yeah, like we just should have more stuff around here. Like this, we need, Jurassic Park needs some trees. It needs some more feeders. It needs like easily accessible food over in the village for the, the dinosaurs. I need to commit to a tree, whether it's the palm tree or the acacia or, wasn't there another one? Didn't I like kind of like the over by Unicorn Meadow where we abandoned that one dinosaur. Didn't I like those trees a lot? Um, see, wheat and apples. Apples is just hard. Um, melon, wheat. And you are not that hungry either. I just, I'm rarely in this chunk, which is nice. So I guess that's part of it. Are you full grown? Sugar and wheat. Um, can you make an apple tree? I can make an apple tree. It's just like, yeah, we could make a couple apple trees. Like, originally I was going to have plans in Mystic Mesa for, like, an amazing orchard. You know what? You need to not live in here. I need to bring you back and name tag you. Um, I want Jurassic Bark to feel... Like, right now it feels a little sad. It feels a little empty. It needs a couple more dinosaurs, but it also just needs some trees and some, like... I think it'd be really cool to have some really tall trees and then some, um, some of these rope bridges so that I could like walk among the trees and not be like in with the dinosaurs. That's definitely going to be the vibe for when there's carnivores. Like if we put carnivores over somewhere else, like over in a different area, I want to have like rope ladders that I can walk on that I don't have to interact with them at all. Um, so anyway, let's go. Let's just go over here. Um, thanks for supporting Razzleberries since she works hard on deco craft. I love Razzleberries. I've met I've met her several times. She's always been incredibly kind to me. I probably don't support her enough. I support her on Patreon. Um maybe a few bushes as well. Yeah, bushes would be nice. I don't know like I guess my whole concern has been do I use Minecraft plants or do I I know that there's like prehistoric plants that I have like shards of or something. So I, I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing that, but let's, these are, these kind of got sad. This one was fully wheat. And then I guess I like worked on it and then something happened where I still had tumbleweeds. And so then I was still sad about them. It's not that we like, cause yes, we could use, um, sugar for a lot of them it's not that i have to have tons of wheat it's just that i use it for the sandwiches uh, i i don't want to make an automatic wheat farm i just want to have a place where there's always a lot of wheat is that so wrong you know but yes this does feel very like it feels like i should have progressed from this like, I started this world in 2016. It feels like I should. And I am. I'm making lots of dinosaurs. It's not like I'm just still doing, like, day one stuff. But, I mean, this specifically is a day one thing. Um. Oh, that's awesome, Warper Warden. Yeah. No, they're really great. Like, they're definitely an inspiration to me. Razzleberries. Um, and, and yeah, hopefully I'll get back to Sweden soon. Oh, weird. I just have random stuff in here. 
Okay, cow. Was that you, Milkbone? Uh, okay. So, great. And then... Is that sand? What was I... Does anyone remember what I was... Was I gonna do sugarcane here? And then I decided to make the farm by my house? Must have. There's my cocoa... Um, which again, like, this is so kind of sad in a way. Um, and like how many cocoa beans, if we're going to have to make a lot of cookies for foot long, like how many, if I harvest all of this, oh, should I use like, you can't use fortune on cocoa beans, 20, that's not bad. But I think we could still do more. And we need like a chest over here, maybe a crafting table kind of a thing. When did I do that? That's funny. How did I, how did I do that? Did I do that accidentally like inside and it spawned? I said I had two fossils. That is really funny. I don't, it bothers me that it's not, like, I want it perfectly on the roof now. Why can you put it on, why can I put it on a roof, but I can't put it on a shelf? Yeah, I might keep it. Um, I wish it was, like, not a Brachiosaur. I wish it was, like, a Pterodactyl or something. You know what I mean? And I wish that the Brachiosaur was, like, I wish that they were life-size. Uh, okay, I guess we need some more jungle wood, some more wood in general, and some dirt. Sorry, I don't know. This isn't going to be the most exciting of streams, but we're going to get some stuff done. But that's not the point of streams. The point of streams, I feel like, is hanging out with everyone. So, I will hang out with you guys and try to look at the chat more. Did I get? Yeah, I got a stack. Okay. What texture pack do you have on? I really don't have a texture pack on besides the one that gives me like blue and white striped stuff. Um, and then I have shaders. Oh, I think that was cow pet. Um, okay, let's, we need some wood. <gasps> I just realized that, hold on, where's my training clicker? We can leave Milkbone in the wheat field that's right there. That's too cute. Um, wood, 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 wood. Spruce, I guess. I hate to use... I was looking just for oak, but spruce will be fine. Um, what was I just saying I needed? I needed wood. But I was also literally just thinking... Well, maybe some jungle wood if I had any, but I don't think I, I don't think I do, but I swear I was just thinking something else and I completely forgot it. Jungle wood to put some cocoa beans on. Cinnamon wood. Um, oh my gosh, I thought I, I thought I just was gonna do something. Oh, the clicker! Thank you. Oh my gosh. I completely forgot. But also, did I lose it in one of those instances? Oh, see, I have three of these saplings. But I feel like I tried to grow them and something bad happened. Or maybe you have to grow them on sand. Um, do you think it's in my bedroom? I don't know where the clicker... I feel like I have not seen it in a while. 
Which leads me to believe that maybe it got lost in one of those unfortunate instances. Um, yeah, I'm sure I can craft it. I'm just not actually sure if it's a difficult recipe. It is not. It is quite easy. Um, okay. All right. The leaves despawned with the petrified saplings. That's what it was, right. Lucretia8403 subscribed at tier three. That is so generous. That is so crazy generous. Thank you so much. Um, smooth stone. Smooth stone and a piece of redstone. I want to make another golem for like the village, you know? Like it's always been my my goal to like close in the village. How do you make this again? It wasn't like that. Was it How do you make this again? Okay. Okay. Do I have another, didn't I have another golden lasso? I don't. So I am going to put you here for now and then golden lasso you and come in here. I need the cow wolf here just because sometimes I need buckets of milk, but this is totally fenced in here and I don't think dogs can ruin your crops so if i click you no longer follow me but i can also stand you up and you can actually completely like roam in here which is so cute milk bone uh okay and then i am going to i don't of course i don't have a shovel and of course it starts raining um In my whole Mystic Mesa world, I only have two chests and some organizers. Listen, this mod pack is difficult in terms of organization. I, I fully understand that. Okay. I'm gonna do a crafting table. Whoops. Um, like here. And then... some chests where we can put our cocoa beans and then we're gonna change this out for wheat I think completely which is gonna be tedious so if you guys have any questions for me uh, ooh, that will stay right two blocks this is why we need a this is why we need a golem at this village. Or actually we don't even really need a golem because we have this insane unicorn back there, the orange one that killed everyone else. I'm still not over that. Milkbone can jump over the chest. Oh, you're right. Why did I think that that was? For some reason, I thought that the chest was outside of the fence. <gasps> Milkbone, my crops!
Okay, apparently that's a vanilla wolf thing. Uh, <laughs> and Stacy's wolf. Ow! No, not my Pegasus! Not my Pegasus! It's a thunderstorm, actually. I can sleep. Of course, I can't sleep if there are things that are... Ow! Sheesh. Will that clear the thunderstorm? No? Okay. I'm running out of sandwiches. Milkbone, you were no help when that just happened. No help. Whatsoever. Ow. Do not kill my Pegasus. Ow. 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 Ow, your armor's pretty good. Ow. Thank you. Um, okay. Well, this has gone terribly wrong because Milkbone cannot live in the wheat field, but that's fine. We'll keep him where he was. Um... Do I plan to get any new dogs anytime soon in real life? Everyone always asks me that, and I guess it's a valid question because I love dogs so much, but no. Like, I just don't have those plans. Um, I Molly is old. She does not want another dog. The, the, I feel like I've answered this so many times, but... It's a simple answer. The reason is that my dad has a dog named Polly and my mom has a dog named Chica and there has been a global pandemic <laughs> and I'm an only child. And so if anything, it's very sad to think about, but if anything were to happen to either of my parents, I would inherit their dogs. And so you could say that I just have one dog, but it feels as though I have one dog, but potentially three dogs in a way and so it just feels like that's that's too risky to get another dog and also like my cabin is very small and pipsqueak had this uh, medical issue where he if he is stressed out he can develop these urinary crystals that can kill him. And so getting another dog would be like a very stressful thing. I'm not saying that I never will again. I'm just saying that like it would probably be a whole ordeal where like I would need to get a puppy so that Pipsqueak can like feel secure of like I'm still the man of the house and this is just a little puppy that I can beat up but it's very hard to rescue a small puppy um you know because so many people like breed puppies um so that would just be like a whole thing and I probably want like a bigger dog but that seems crazy because I don't have, like, a, a lot of space at the cabin. So, no. Is the answer. <laughs> Do I like scary movies? No. Not at all. Not at all. Where? Oh, hi. This is power five, and it is. I don't know why I'm not one hitting these zombies. I think I might want to put um, flame or punch on these because I just think I'm having to to shoot these guys a lot. You know. What if I made sand dunes in your mesa? Oh, that would be a lot of work. The mesa is as good as Utah, in my opinion. Would you be willing to make another Mystic Mesa series? What would be the point? I have this series. You mean like another series on my YouTube channel? Or like another another world? I would never make another Mystic Mesa world. 
I have this one. Um, still interested in the hay bale trees? Yes, we will go over there as soon as I fix this and just... I still want these. Like, I don't... I don't know. I don't like the idea of just, like... I wish I could burn all the hay bale trees and then get the hay still. Like, I hate the idea of just having a bunch of odd nether rack spires over there. Because wasn't it nether rack, not jungle wood for the base of the trees? Hello, Enderman. All right, so Milkbone sadly has lost privileges. Milkbone, I can't believe it. I can't believe it, Milkbone. You're really j ow! Power five. Thank you. Seriously. Okay, go back in there. Um. Yeah, Milkbone has completely betrayed me. Oh, they're already growing. So this is good. I think we had, like, some of them eat melon. I, eventually, okay. Like, you know how I'm always like, there's only a few things I want to do in Mystic Mesa. I want to get all of the wolves, and I want to get a lot of the dinosaurs, and then kill the Ender Dragon. There's still, like, I originally wanted every house in this village to have, like, a purpose. And have, like, a golem and a fenced-in area. I don't even know if we have any villagers left. I had them all in, um... Oh, my. I had them all at one point in a building trapped. But I don't even know if they're all still well. But I guess we don't have melon. I had... I guess I had pumpkins here. Okay. I just completely forgot to come do this once the... Tumbleweeds got disabled. Okay. What wolves are left for you to find? The lapis wolf and the emerald wolf. Um, and the bookcase wolf and the end wolf. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wait, what? Oh my gosh. You're mean, but like in a good way. But yeah, see, I had some villagers. <laughs> I think they're. I think this whole village is dead now. Um, wow. Is it night yet? Because I am over this rain. I'm so over. Come on. Oh, I need. I need sandwiches too. Let's go get some bread, and then we can go make some more sandwiches. The thing is, is, like, we should do an apple orchard because we need something. We need to farm one fruit. Not that I like peanut butter and apple jelly sandwiches, but they're not bad. But I need one fruit that is just, like, we have so much of it for whenever I have to make sandwiches. Because usually... It's like, well, I have, um, I have like five raspberries. I have a couple blackberries, but I do need like a fruit that's just like, you've got stacks and stacks of this. And if it could be something that then also, uh, benefited the dinosaurs, then great. I've lost my way towards that. I should pull out my map. It's this way, no? 
I'm looking for Nightmare Oasis. Is it right here? I'm going to play an ad while I find it. Is it over here? The Cave and Cliff update will come out in two different... Yeah, I talked about that a little bit in yesterday's stream. I think it's fine. Uh, yeah. Okay, here it is. See, these actually kind of look cool. I hate to destroy them. I really kind of do. But we will destroy some, like, over here, maybe. Well, no, I, I like them. It's, call me crazy. I like these weird hay bale trees. This is also painful. Like, okay, now it's night, right? No? Okay, Hercules? Do, no, no, Hercules? No. Fine. Just don't abandon me. I need food. My sweatshirt matches the Pegasus mane. <laughs> When you make bookcase wolves, you should give it a bookcase golem friend. <laughs> did you see the, did you, did you happen to see when I looked at Stella the unicorn, there was, you know what? I think a hoe is faster than shears. Uh, there was a grave in the background of this very stream, right? When I just looked at that orange Pegasus unicorn thing and it said, Casey, Rest in peace. Disappeared. Casey was my bookcase wolf. From the very, very beginning of Mystic Mesa, I spawned in my first special golem. I chose the bookcase wolf. I named the bookcase wolf Casey. And he read a book that taught him how to brew an invisibility potion and drank it and left. I wish I was lying. <laughs> That's... I... I wish I was lying. <laughs> I didn't know that that would happen. <laughs> no, not a bookshelf wolf, a bookshelf golem. Sorry. The bookshelf golem, apparently they can read the books that are on them that teach them magic. So, I mean, this is, yeah, that's a lot. So, great. Great. This was a great plan. This is better. This was better. I still am happy to have the wheat fields, but, like, no, look. We never, like, oh, yeah, this, okay, I was wrong. This is, we have everything we need here. And the sun is shining. Perfect day. What animal would I want them to include in vanilla Minecraft? I feel like they, I feel like the Minecraft team has spoiled us recently with so many new, like, I'm so excited for the goat. I'm so excited for the axolotl. Um, so like, I don't really know. Like, I feel like for me to even say, I wish there was this animal is like, no, I'm just happy to like, see what they put in next. Like, I don't feel like it's. Like, I don't feel like I, <laughs> this is going to be weird. Uh, NC Jester, thank you so much for the biscuits. I feel like I've lost the right to complain about vanilla Minecraft once they started adding so many new features and mobs so regularly. Like, I feel like back in 2016, it was like, oh, yeah, I want them to add this animal. <laughs> and now I feel like they've added so many. That I'm like, yeah, sure, thank you. Thank you, thank you for all. I love them all. Thank you. Um, 
So, so anyway, yeah. How do I say the word in the title? It's a Pachycephalosaurus. And this is my baby Pachycephalosaurus. Pratzel, he's hanging out with me. Uh, anyway, I don't want him to grow up too fast. So that's why he's hanging out in the golden lasso while we get some, oh, this is the, that's, okay. We have reached the part. It's not too bad of a drop actually, but we have reached the edge of this particular tree. Yeah, I mean, if I had to add a, a mob to vanilla, like, I was kind of excited for the vulture because it was going to be native to the mesa, and the mesa doesn't really have a mob that spawns exclusively in it. In fact, not very many mobs at all spawn in the mesa, and so... If I had to add an animal, I would just be like, please hurry up and add. I think they're still going to. It would be like, just please add the vulture because I, I'm excited for that. Like, there's just not an, enough. Like, there's not a bird. There's phantoms and there's bats. But, and there's bees. But I think, um, I think having a bird bird would be fun. So, that would be my... I'm not going to just like come up with some random new mob. I would just say the, the vulture. A fennec fox? Well, I have a fennec fox in Dogcraft, so I think it would be cool for vanilla, but I leave that to their team. I wish that there would be another friendly fantasy mob like the mushroom. But I get why there's not. Um, but it's like the fact that they add so many hostile fantasy mobs like the warden. I would like a fantasy friendly mob. But actually I kind of like I the strider kind of was that. Like I spent so many times think, being like all the fantasy mobs that come out now are hostile. But the Strider is not, like, the Strider is friendly. So, and you can ride it. So, so the point is, is that Stace is a pretty, Stace is a pretty happy um, Minecraft player recently. Ow. Uh, okay. Let's get all, we have so much. We, like, just, that was just one tree and, like, we're good. We have so much. All right, Hercules, why have you done this to me? Why have you done this at all, Hercules? Oh yeah, there's parrots, I forgot about parrots. But the vulture still, I, I, I stand by that. Hercules. I can't get to you now. Why have you done this to me? That thing about fall damage, I think that was, I think that was fall damage on hay bales. I think that's a thing that was added later in the game than this. I think I will still hurt myself pretty bad if I do this, but I'm going to. Ow. Not too bad, actually. All right, take me down. Take me down, because I do think some hay bales might have fallen down here. No? Yeah. Hello, random un- OW! Kick damage on, I see. Okay, we, we did well. We did very, very well.
Do do do. Bye, Adeline. Only Grazer's allowed to call me Stasinator. Just kidding. Not a bird. Parrots say, are we a joke to you? Yes. <laughs> You're still waiting for vertical half slabs? What would you really do with them? I'm sure a builder would know. Uh, cashew! Hello, Cashew. You're my favorite. I love you, Cashew. Hello, Hippocamps. Hello, Boganip. I'm sorry that I'm riding Hercules. It's for your protection. Oh, hello, Prismarine thing that I have to take down because it was a huge failure. So much to do in this series, honestly. I'm coming over, actually, yeah, I think we're going to build the apple orchard over here, even though I don't think that these are spawn chunks for me, so that's probably a bad idea. I just think it would look the best, but, like, I have a random assortment of fruit trees here? Where? Here. Somewhere. Here. And here we go. Ah, so see, we could just have an apple tree like here. Because these are, this is my cherry tree. <gasps> oh, I'm sorry. Oh, that's terrible. But there, I don't know. I should have cut down trees and like done something else here to really... Okay, never mind. We're going to make the apple orchard over here. I just don't know where yet. But it doesn't make sense to not have it be in a spawn chunk of my house. Do you know what I mean? But I'll make jam out of all these things, I guess. It's just that's dumb too, though, because then I have just a bunch of random... Is my inventory full of actual hay bales? Um... Yeah, it's tricky because then I just have random sandwiches that don't stack. Um, so I don't know. Where could we put apple trees? Hercules. Could just put them right here. Just put some random apple trees here, maybe. Like, why not? Maybe. The problem is, is I don't think we have any apples to start our apple orchard. This always happens to me. Okay, I'm going to take a quick break. I'm going to go get some water. I'm going to play an ad. I'll be right back. We'll do apple trees. Um... And I need to make sandwiches. All right. I'll be right back. Hello, hello. How is everyone's break? I need apples. Um. Okay. I think this is fine. For our apple orchard. Hercules, why? Why do you do this? Why do you choose chaos? Every chance you get. Every chance. Did I get my water? Oh, wait. No. I went to the bathroom. And then I didn't get water. Ugh, I'm sorry, I'll be right back.
You need to stay hydrated? Yes. I... I'll try not to do a whole rant on that, but I think that those... I think when people on Twitch have, like, a hydration reminder that viewers put on, it just drives me nuts. I... I... I am very hydrated. I probably drink, like, at least two of these a day, if not two and a half. Hi, Bree. Yeah, no. <laughs> I shouldn't start drama because it's that's lovely that some people drink on command. I just find it very odd. I would never... I would never... do that um okay so listen we're we don't have apples we don't hercules Her hercules Poganip would never do this, Hercules, okay? Poganip would never. Oh my gosh, you're way over. Are you kidding me? I'm out of, I need sandwiches. I need, oh my gosh. Stop, where are you going? You're the worst. Ah! Whoa, zombies? Hey, stop it! What are you, wisp? Are you wisp in disguise? That's a total wisp move. So this is fun. Way back when Mystic Mesa first started, I was like, I am going to have the most perfect orchard tree farm with every kind of tree. And I decided to like space the, I had big plans. I was like, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna build my whole dinosaur metropolis here. So I better put my tree farm all the way over here, which I did. And then the trees never grew. Be oh, yay, I was right. We have apples. We can make an apple farm by our house. Um. Anyway, that's, such good news. I thought I was going to have to cut down those other trees to get, um, why can't I harvest this one? Is it not grown? Okay. Um, we need, well, we do need oak saplings. So I actually will cut down one of these now that I think about it. Now that I think about it, I actually will. Uh, okay. Get some saplings. I probably have saplings at my house, but it's fine. Oh, hi. I did not see the chest here. Never mind. We're good. To the house. Uh, yes. Okay. Do, do, do. I don't even really, I'm gonna just throw you in here, I think, because I just don't know what to do. Can you fly away though? Probably. Be nice, everyone doesn't have kick, no one has kick damage on, right? Icy wing buffet? Tell me more. Tell me more. Okay. Felger? Why are you down here? 
Mars! Mars! Two years! Two Who's growling? Oh. Are you mad at Felger? I think this random Mesa wolf is mad at Felger. Wow. Um, not Mars, thank you. Thank you so much. Um, it's cold in my cabin. <laughs> um, thank you so, so much. Happy two years. Enjoy the big pippy. Um, okay. I cannot have this much stuff in my... Inva. As Grazer would call it, my Inva. Inva. Too much stuff. Okay, this is really unfortunate. No, you stay. Okay, snarling wolf, calm down. Calm down. I want these. Okay. Let's do this. We have our apple appling. We have our applings. <laughs> Apple saplings. Um uh, Wait, it just says Mars subscribed. At tier two! No! <laughs> Enjoy the big pippy, but no. Wait, what is that? No. No. That's too generous. I love you guys too. You guys are too nice to me. I don't need you to do that. Like you guys work so hard. Seriously. I'm gonna cry. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, friends. Ah, uh, friendship. <laughs> um, thank you. Okay, let's make some sandwiches. Let's make some bread. Here we go, making the bread. Um, well, I should keep some of this as wheat because that was the whole point was that it's for the dinosaurs. Yes. Okay, so we'll make a bunch of bread, but then we also need to take like, let's take, uh, let's save a stack of hay bales for going and giving the dinosaurs more. F we need to make more feeders for the dinosaurs, essentially. Okay. 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 Um... Have you watched any good animal documentaries lately? I don't think so. I don't think so. If you have any good ones to recommend. Animal documentaries are like really kind of scary. Because it's like, I don't want to... I don't want to see any animals die. That's not what I watch TV for. You know? I'm really making too much bread. Someone should stop me. Um, truly. Oh, but peanuts are not bread. You know what? No, there's there's more I can make. Let's sleep. Even though I love nighttime, I'm just scared of being in my house and having mobs. This Mesa Wolf needs to... Needs to go. 
We love you, Stacy. You are so appreciated for being you and sharing your time with us. Thank you for the biscuits so much. You really? You went to Yellowstone last week and ended up seeing two wild wolves in Lamar Valley play fighting. Yes. I Okay. So the person who asked me, I did see a recent, it wasn't a documentary, but I did see a video of wolf pups in Yellowstone recently. They, like, there are wolf puppies right now, and it's literally making me want to just take a weekend. I've never been to Yellowstone in the winter when there's still a lot of snow, but, like... I'm kind of wanting to just go up there and drive through the whole park. Like, it would be such a quick trip in my mind because I would go up, I'd drive up, I'd sleep, and then I would wake up in the morning super early, drive through the whole park, just looking for wolves, and then probably just drive home that same day. One night. I kind of want to do it. I kind of want to do it. Monkey Boy 21 gave a gift sub to Ark and Whale. It's their first gift sub of the channel. What's my hair doing? Um, Monkey Boy, thank you so much. Anyway, yeah, the Lamar Valley is usually when I go to Yellowstone where people say that you could go see wolves. But I always go in the summer and wolves just, they're just hiding in the summer it's so crowded for tourist season but i'm i keep going back to like wait a minute i own a jeep it can drive in the snow and it's april now so it's not there's not even that much snow like what am i waiting for why do i never go to yellowstone in the winter like i'm really tempted to just do it oh people are saying to do it okay well if I, if I end up randomly canceling the streams next week. <laughs> Just kidding. I don't know what day I would do it on. Maybe I would do it on a day where I could still stream. But it's crossed my mind. I Like, I don't know why I didn't. Especially, like, in a pandemic year of all years. Like, yeah. Like, I feel like I'm messing up. Like, let's just go. Let's just go. I don't... I would never want to, like, interact with a wolf. You know, I'd never want to. I just want to see it from my car. Um, okay. Let's make some peanut butter. Let's make... How much sugar do we have? <gasps> what? Are we seriously out of... We have 29 sugar. That cannot stand. What it, Do I have a sugar waypoint? Do I have do I have a sugar waypoint? Maybe not because it is literally like right up here. I I might I just might not because it's it's actually like ridiculously close I still can't sprint this is obnoxious um loomy lights you're so welcome thank you so much hello jello why are you here um okay ow <gasps> no I'm supposed to I'm supposed to only break it at this level oh gosh I just I just really messed up where are my ducks <gasps> you know what I was gonna do like once upon a time hi guys hi oh I did it I was gonna get more hay bales which I have now to like finish Decorating. How do you... How do you put them like that? Yeah. There 
you guys go. Like a little soft area. Oh, no. That's not what I was going to do. I was going to do... I was going to do it back here. So that they can, like, go in and roost. Does that bother me? I think it kind of doesn't bother me. Like, I think it's kind of fun when it's, like, all mix-matched. Oh. Why did I think that there was another layer? I really, really did. I have regrets. Okay. Are there three ducks here, by the way? Wow, this is legit organization in Mystic Mesa. I'm so proud of myself. Uh, did I pick it all up? I guess I did. All right, thanks guys. It's been a pleasure. It's been an absolute, you guys are so cute. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Am I ever going to do another mind clash with Grazer? I don't know. I mean, we, we like, I feel really bad saying this, but, like, at a certain point, like, things end, guys. Like, we did so many. Like, hundreds. <laughs> so, so, like, I don't know. It's really interesting to, like, it's sort of interesting to, like, have this weird type of relationship on YouTube where it's, like, people like things and so they want me to do more, but then... Like, I also get to choose what I do, and I want to make people happy, but then, yeah, I don't know. Strange. But yeah, I mean, we've, we've done a lot. I really, oh my gosh, my favorite thing that I don't think I will ever, like, I don't know if I'll ever top it, is like, I love the tower challenges. I just, I, I feel like I invented that, kind of. Maybe I didn't. Um, saucepan, is that what we're talking? Yeah, okay. All right. Gooseberry, yeah, sure. Plum, cherry. This is weird that I've done this, but it's fine. Um, that's not even that much sugar still. Uh, saucepan, okay. Let's make some sandwiches. Um, okay, let's see here. Bread, cutting board, jam, and peanut butter. See, I'm gonna just have a random assortment of sandwiches based on all of these different jellies. Which is why having just apple would be nice, because otherwise I have to just carry all of these around in my gooseberry jelly sandwich. Um, yeah, I just have to carry all of these around, which is kind of strange. Um, okay. Put some more bread in there. And then finally, which should we eat? The gooseberry, maybe? Let's eat the gooseberry. Um... Have I listened to Fearless Taylor's version? I, again, I'm just being so controversial today. I have met Taylor Swift. I have interviewed her. I'm not necessarily, she just doesn't make my kind of music. So I have not, but I'm sure it's good. And I fully love what she's doing to release her new albums or her old albums, I guess I should say. I think it's really smart, but no. 
Uh, okay. So it's sad that we only have six because I think I put down eight slots for our apple orchard. We also might as well just grow them up with bone meal now. Why not? Because I have, I have it. Um. I love how when I said <laughs> that I might not bring this one particular series back. Everyone was just like, okay, well then I'll ask about another series. Oh, look at that. They're, I thought I spaced them out enough. This is just, this is going horribly. These, these apple trees are like bigger than normal oak trees, no? Or I just, no, I'm just bad at spacing. Wow, okay. I also forgot that they're just ugly when they're in a mesa. But my apple orchard, sadly. Uh, Odette! Odette! There is a bird sanctuary now, but it doesn't have a pond. Should we make a pond in the bird sanctuary? Like, I'm just a. I'm, I'm fearful that birds will somehow drown. If it's one block deep, there's no way they will drown, right? Now, basically, the person who just asked about Noob Quest, I will do one more episode of Noob Quest. That is like, that is a undeniable goal that I have that I still want to do. How did this baby zombie thing happen? Where is the baby zombie? Shouldn't it be like right? Oh, no. Where? Why don't I know my own house? It's like, it should be, I can hear it. Where, it shouldn't it be like right, oh, it's here. Hi. Hi, baby zombie. Hello. 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 Hi, what are you holding? Hello. Hello. Hi. What are you holding? A feather? Are you holding a feather? Did you kill a bird? Did you kill a bird of mine? Ow. Hey, ow. Oh, he must be. Oh, no. He couldn't burn in sunlight. Is that not a one seven ten thing? Um, he must have been focused on a villager. Um, what was I just doing? Oh, yeah, one level water pond in the bird area, or no? I'm too scared. Also, do I have bird cages? No. Um. I'm so scared of it for some reason. Where are all my buckets? I need, I have buckets. Oh my gosh, thank you so much for the biscuits. Oh yes, frozen meat to get new dinosaur DNA. I have so much dinosaur DNA though. Um, I'm gonna run a quick ad while I fix my shaders. Uh, that's not it. Thank you so much for the biscuits. That's so nice. Oh, he died on a cactus. That makes sense. <laughs> Utah Raptors exclamation point. I don't know the context, but sure. Utah Raptors. Um, why do I keep doing this? I keep doing the same thing. I keep going into my texture things. I say Utah Raptors for what? What, what, what for? They're great. Um, I'm pretty sure velociraptors were kind of small and I've heard this story, but I don't know if it's actually true or not, but the story goes 
that when they were making Jurassic Park, like, I can't remember. I've read the book, and I really liked the book. But I feel as though... Um, I feel as though the in the book, Velociraptors were quite small. And then Steven Spielberg was like, that's not scary. They need to be like six feet tall so that they're kind of like as big as you. Uh, because that would be really scary. Like, obviously, T-Rex is huge and that's scary. But if the Velociraptors are like three feet tall, they'll kill you. But it's just not as, like, movie monster to have this teeny little thing. And so the paleontologist that was consulting on Jurassic Park, again, this could all just be, like, a tall tale, but this is what has been told to me, is that Jack Horner consulted on the movie and was like, you can't do that. You can't just make the Velociraptor bigger. And Steven Spielberg was like, sorry, I'm going to. And then as they were filming, the discovery of the, what would then be called the Utah Raptor was made. And Utah Raptors are like six feet tall, which is essentially the height that he wanted them to be. Um, you want me to go to my sugarcane farm to take a screenshot, which is a little strange because you can just watch the VOD of it, but I, I will indulge this. I don't know. Like, do you want me to smile while, like, is it like a, this kind of a situation of my sugarcane farm? Are you making a thumbnail? Like, should I, should I disable my, my webcam? And then like this? Or is it more like, um, do you want me in it? More like this? Or or do you actually want me in the sugarcane farm? Like, am I supposed to be down here? Like this? I'm gonna hold still right like this. I'm just gonna watch the ducks, really. Let me know when you got it. How's it, how's it going? High view. Oh, okay, my bad, my bad. Up here. Okay. Like this? Or like, what if I actually block up a bit? Okay, and F1? and like straighten it a bit like this how's that you got it oh, okay you got it okay okay all right cool uh, <laughs> all right great phew uh all right let's go ahead and why am i whispering i don't know because my face was gone so oh i just broke a ladder i think did i get it back where's my ladder ah got it Okay, hi, Daffa, and ladder. All right, uh, I'm back. What were we doing anyway, in any case? Oh, should I make a one block water? We have to bring Odette to the bird aviary, but should I make a one block tall? What is that? Uh, a squid. Should I make a one block tall water feature in the air? I just am so scared that somehow a hummingbird or something will like fall into the water and drown. Like, are all the birds able to swim? Like, will they drown? If it's one block tall, they should not be able to. Like, it should be okay. Like, they shouldn't be able to die, right? Gooseberry jelly sandwich time. Um, 
Um, okay, I'm going to put up a poll for this. Manage a poll. No, no, no. New poll. Water, fountain, bird bath? Yes. No. Death. No, because death. Uh, okay, starting the poll. <laughs> uh, put a half slab under the water. Can you do that? That'll just suck up the water. Right. You can't do that. Right? You can't, you can't do that. You can't, you can't do that, right? I'm 99% sure that you can't do that. But now I'm questioning if I have a weird mod that actually does let me do that somehow. Okay, granite is like the one block I can't make a slab out of. Okay, there's no way, you can't do this. You can't do this. By the way, what did I miss? Oh my gosh, Hi Arma is giving a sub to Dakota Hazel 18, that's so nice. And Ginger Jacks just subscribed for 11 months. Um, yes, you can. Do you pour the water first or do you pour the water second? Okay, there's water in there and now I'm putting a slab. It took the water. So if there's a slab there, it places the water on top. Yeah, you guys, I know Minecraft. I've been playing this game a little bit. A little bit. I played it a bit. Just a bit. I'm going to run some ads while the poll is still going. And then I will eagerly await the answers. Slab then water? Nope. Um. Oh, wait. Hold on. I missed. Okay, the poll is going pretty... I think it's going to be a yes, but we will wait until it's totally done. Um, oh yeah. Like I think that that is maybe something that they fixed, but this I'm on a very old mystic Mesa has existed since 2016. So I'm on a very old version of Minecraft, so I don't doubt that you can do that with slabs now. I just can't. Sorry. I totally forgot that that might have been something that you guys could have done. Um, for sure. In your own worlds. I think this room desperately needs a pond. There's just so much brown. Is that a dodo egg? I got a dodo egg! No dodo. Tchaikovsky! Oh my gosh, I love Tchaikovsky. And I have Odette. And is Odile here? Odile. The black swan. Although... You're the black swan. But, like, I think that Odette doesn't have yellow around their eyes, do they? No! So that's how you know that you're Odile. Oh, I'm so obsessed with Swan Lake. Um, One block pond. Did it win? Yes, it won. Okay. I'm going to make an endless water source first. So, there we go. If any of my birds die, you guys are all directly responsible for their deaths. And then I'm going to fill up these three buckets with the endless water source. 
And then I'm just gonna kind of like do a little sort of like free form. I don't know exactly like what I want my pond to be shaped like. Something like a little organic kind of. Uh. Oop, it's nighttime. Let's sleep. I don't want any skeletons spawning in here. Uh, I also feel just scared that they could spawn it. I think this is nice. I'm going to just do a little bit more. I take it back. I take back. I take back you. Where did all my hardened clay just go? Why am I not picking it up? Is it? Oh, is it dark brown? Is it? Perfect. Okay, so water, 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 water. Oh, I think it's good. <gasps> it's so low. Like, look at Plum the Kiwi. Plum the Kiwi looks like she would drown in a blow. We have to test it. We have to make sure that this is plum proof. Plum, you're at 60%. Why? Plum! Get out of the water, Plum! Live! She's trapped in a block now! Oh, gosh! Okay, I think it's fine. I think it's fine, and I almost want one over here, too, because this area over here is kind of... I think that would be nice, too. Um, so let's do the same thing. <laughs> Please don't let a hummingbird die. I hope not. Why is it shaped like that? Because I'm an artist. Obviously. I don't know. I just don't want it shaped perfect. I want it like organically. Like it should be like an organic shape that is not just like, oh, hold on. I need to do a endless water source first. Like, it's supposed to be like nature. Are you? You're up here. Okay. Hi, Twitch. Uh, okay. There we go. So, I will... I have to be careful swinging this pickaxe around. Like, we could... We could kill some people. <gasps> Permafrost! You're on the bird bath! Okay. Oh, no! Oh, no! I think I just flooded my house. Oh, no! Where's my golden lasso? Is there a bird here? No, okay, it's blocks. Oh my gosh, I'm so terrified that I'm gonna kill a bird. All right, there. I like it. I like it, and I really hope that no birds die in my bird pond. That would be incredibly sad. Um, you have a question. Am I going to get another dog? The VODs for this stream are usually available. <laughs> I already answered. No, I'm not. Um, I hate to, I feel like I have to do the whole explanation, but I guess I just don't. Like, no, I'm not getting another dog. Um, I, it makes me sad because dogs are awesome, but I have a dog and her name is Molly and she's right over there and she's perfect. 
So you can't mess with perfection. Okay, birds, enjoy. Enjoy. Enjoy dumpling, everyone. I'm just gonna, I just wanna make sure that I don't need to rescue a bird. Hi, hi, dumpling. He loves me. He loves me so much. Um, I just wanna make sure, it looks really cool. This room could still look a little cooler, you know? Maybe a few more vines. You know, we don't have any vines, like, hanging down, necessarily. Like, what I should do is I should take some of the vines and just throw it. I should, um, where did I just put my shears? Like, now that the, like, these will regrow. So I should take some of them. What is that called in like, when you have plants? It's called like, um, it's called something. It's not like siphoning, but it's like repopulating or like re, propagation. Yes, purple polar bear 201. Thank you so much. Yeah, I should add more perches, but I also just want some more vines like, like, I'd like a vine coming off of a sea lantern, you know? Why not? Like, hanging down. I think that that would be really cool. Um, thank you so much for the all the biscuits. Hi, Arma. That is too kind. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. Um, that is so sweet. Uh, okay, a little couple more weeds, not weeds, vines. Do they grow on windows? No. Right there, can I put one there? Nice. Yeah, I just want there to be a little bit more foliage, I think. Dusty, I forgot that you were up here. Are you okay? All right, well, oh, dumpling just dipped Dumplings fine with the water. That was my big concern. Claire is taking a bath. Claire certainly enjoys it. So, okay. I think it's great. I think that's fine. I cannot believe that this whole stream has gone by and I have spent very little time with the whole point of, of what I'm excited about right now. Which is... Pretzel! We haven't even named you. Let's name Pretzel. We've got to. For the stream. Whoa. Party in here. Um. Did I make the Pacquiao home? No. I totally failed. I failed. The whole point of the stream today was to make the Pacquiao home, but I, I did kind of like, I got the apples going, I got the wheat going for our dinosaurs. Um, you know, it wasn't it a uh, pretzel that eats wheat? Am I lying? I need to do um, pretzel. I need to do an egg sorter upstairs. You can't even walk in that room without having 80 eggs in your inventory. Oh my golly. There we go. Okay, Pretzel. And your name's Pretzel. Pretzel the Pachycephalosaurus who wants to eat wheat. I was right, okay. So pretzel, look. Look at all the wheat I have. <gasps> this better not grow you up. Pachycephalosaurus is full. Okay, great. All right. Let's go to... I still need to figure out the feeders. Is it raining again? Okay, you only eat cookies because you're awesome, but didn't you eat wheat and I fed you? 
Or no, you ate seeds. Do you eat wheat, Tara? Tara, what do you eat? Yeah, you eat wheat. Calm down. Are you full? No, you're pr you're basically full. And then Leaf, I think, eats. Do 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 do. How did I make pretzel? A Pachycephalosaurus DNA. Stegosaurus is full. And then. Do you eat anything besides? You eat apples and cookies and sugar. And I have a lot of sugar, but I also have now. Oh, thanks for the coal. I have cocoa beans here now. So I can just make myself some cookies. And come back here. And make sure that you, my sweet footlong, get a whole stack of cookies. Yay! All right. Thank you guys. This was awesome. Sleep and make a day. Put pretzel down. Ah! Oh, I love him so much. Oh, I love him. <sighs> Did it start raining again? Or just didn't clear up? All right. Okay. Well, that is going to do it for today. Um... Let's see here. That was so much fun. That was so much fun. Um, let's, well, let's see here. I want to do a raid. Let's raid um, Kim. Uh, Kimmy because they're playing Minecraft. We raided them yesterday and they were so incredibly sweet about our community um, She's playing Minecraft so let's do it and you guys are just awesome raiders and And since she's playing Minecraft, it'll be perfect and I will see you guys later um, Yeah, but until next time Pedro Mo, I love you. Goodbye, go rescue a dog. Goodbye, random. Goodbye, Tristiania. Goodbye, Bambi. Go rescue a dog.